well, welcome back, everyone. Ah, man. The journey I've had to get back to this house. You may notice our guy's name here is, uh... What the fuck? Um, hello? I guess I can't open menus when I'm paused. Okay, yeah, I can't open or close menus, but I can switch between them. Anyway, you might notice that our guy's name is now Greg McFall. We had a bit of a problem with our last guy. Namely, I died shortly after leaving the house. Because we were quite far away, right? So, let me just open up the map here real quick. So last time we had started down here again or something, right? Well, I made it to about here before I died. And then we spawned down here somewhere as our next guy. I made it to, like, here before we died. Then we spawned down here again. <laughs> no, I think actually we spawned up here or somewhere. And then we died again. So I went through a couple of characters, mainly because it was night. I wasn't looking around for zombies or being quiet. I was just running. And uh, finally, we spawned down here-ish. I went through this parking lot and found a green taxi that had a key in it miraculously. Uh, so we grabbed the key, uh, drove the taxi up here, up over here, filled it up because it was about to run out of gas, literally. I think if I would have tried to come to the apartment building, I would have run out of gas. So yeah, uh, after we filled up, we went over here. And I was like, hey, maybe I can sneak back into this building and get my gear. So I, uh, as you can see here, we uh, went out. And as you can tell, it wasn't easy. Uh, I didn't even get near the building. I got to, again, if we open up the map, I got to about here, and there's still a lot of zombies in this area, like a lot of zombies. So I uh, went ahead and banished myself up, and I've been preparing to go back out. Uh, I've just been spending a couple of days recuperating, and of course, that's still wounded there. But my thigh, is the thigh ready? Yeah, the thigh is fine, okay. So, yeah, I spent some time doing some things. And, uh, yeah, so now I have a bunch of pipes, because previously I'd went out without recording, and I was just like, yeah, I'm just gonna try to get my stuff back, or I guess, uh, it would be Ethan's stuff back, so I was like, I'll just go and see if I can sneak around and grab it quickly. Didn't end up working out very well for us, so that is when I decided that, okay, we need to come back, grab just a bunch of pipes, and we're going to have to start clearing stuff again. You can see my new taxi over there. A little bit bloody on the front because I used it to uh, clear some people away from it. Let's see how many people are down here. Oh, that's a couple of people. Every time I went over here, I would uh, be getting terrified, so I was curious... But why? Turns out these guys are the reason for that. Damn. Somebody at least bashed their heads in a little bit there, but... So we're just gonna start some zombie clearing tactics. Should've brought some beta blockers. That's on me. And then push, and then we're gonna go... Alright. Previously, I'd been messing with some zombies in that field. As you can see, they kind of gathered there. I want these guys to kind of spread out a little bit. So let's go ahead and hop this fence. We can take a moment to get less panicked. This this field is just going to be like a wasteland of discarded weapons. Like that bat there. There's uh, a shotgun right there. Stuff there. I know I dropped a pipe up there further near the playground area. But jeez louise. Climb back over now. I think some of them will come back. 
which is what I want. I'm gonna try and sneak away a little bit. We lost a couple, or those guys were just there already, I don't know which, but anyway. Oh, God damn it. That was so good, so many of them just fell right there. No biting, get away from me. Come on. I could probably definitely be doing this a smarter way. I just don't know how right now. Okay, let's push these guys away. Let's check our back, because like I said, there were zombies up here before. We're just gonna take a moment, walk around a little bit. Uh, collect ourselves, get a little less terrified, and, uh, I don't like how they're not in, like, a line. This is why I brought multiple. Also, that one was pretty much broken anyway when I had it. Let's equip the lead pipe. Uh, equip. Alright, who wants some next? Uh, oops. That was just bad timing on my part. Hey, how about you don't? I said, how about you don't, though? Like, what if you just didn't? Hmm? Someone's alarm's going off. That's drawing in more zombies, which is... Less than ideal. Did you guys just fucking stop? Whose fucking watch is that? Is it this one? That's not a digital, so that wouldn't do it. No alarm, please. Let me drop that back there. Okay. Uh, uh. <sighs> Done a little bit. So our plan right now, we're going to try and clear out uh, our frontal area here, which should help us uh, in the future. And because the zombies shouldn't be um, respawning anymore. We shouldn't have another group gather in front of us unless we bring them there on purpose for some reason. Also, I just got really hot for some reason. Like me as a person. I don't know why. Oh, come on, you little shits. I like how there's just like a trail of fallen zombies that are like on their back around me, here and there. We can run. Jump! 
Uh, we also got a little exhausted, so jumping over there is probably a good idea for us right now. Okay, let's sit. Recuperate. So some of them are going down here, some of them aren't. Better idea might be to just come down here and deal with the ones that are coming towards me, huh? That way I don't have to deal with a bunch of them out at one time, you know? Probably sure that zombie got me. I don't really have too much uh, defense on me right now, so... I don't have very much spare clothing, right? This is just a leather jacket I found from some dead guy. Oh, you motherfucker. Get off me! Hold on, we're jumping the fence again. Bastard got my fucking leg. What a prick. We we're doing so well, and then I was just like, oh, I'll be able to melee this zombie who's crawling in the fucking face before he gets me, and. Didn't work. Didn't work at all. But at least we only have three more zombies here. Then we can go back for more, although we are getting hungry, so I might have time to be about raiding the thing. We're also limping a little bit, it looks like. Get fucked, guy. Alright. Come here, crawlers. Come here. Hell is that, like? Wussy little swing there. How's the pipe? Pipe's still doing good. Alright, it... <sighs> With a herd down there? Where do they keep crawling in from? Anyway, it might be a good time to go back upstairs. We can rest a little bit. The, the clock, thank you. Ugh. Incidentally, I don't know if... Uh, I, mentioned, I think I mentioned it when we were building our new character, but if you look at our stats, we have more strength, which is great. Um, oh, apparently I can't open that. I don't have any thing to open stuff down here. If I had a screwdriver, I could. Let's just drink a pop then. That gives me hunger release. There we go. Might as well light one up while we're at it. Let's check our upper arm. Yep, it's still infected. Or not infected, it's still damaged. That's a thing. I do have pain pills on me, but I'm not gonna do too much. Alright. <sighs> Get the next group. How many more are left down here? Quite a few. Shasha. Alright. Try to lure them away a few at a time. That way we can actually deal with them without having to like create a huge train and problem over here. They really love to just go down right after like I can't melee them when they're on the ground. They'll be so resistant to falling over until, like, someone else comes up behind them. And then when that happens, they're like, oh, ho, just kidding. Damn it. They were too fanned out. I couldn't get them all. All right. That's that group. Let's see if they have any, uh... 
decent armor for me to wear. Not armor, but just clothing in general, I suppose. You know what? Maybe I'll wear these jeans instead of the uh, shorts that I'm wearing. That might provide me a little bit more protection. All right. I think we'll be a little more protected like this. Do you have anything on you, miss, that would be a little more protected? Not really. Wait, hold on. Wasn't there a... Uh... I know that was somewhere else. Well, yeehaw, folks. Let's get down to it. Because our man, Greg McFall, is gonna make these zombies McFall on their fucking rear ends or something. Okay, just a trip chance, which I hate. Hey, over here. I see some of y'all coming. Let's go. And that's if I could level up our sneaking stat too while I'm at this. <sighs> Alright, let's go. Come on, you lot. Let's return you back to the earth where you belong. one good thing, I think, about us uh, having changed up that setting to make zombies actually not respawn uh, when we did. I think we made it in time to where all those zombies we killed with the guns. Um, like when we were rolling around in the hospital. I think we made it in time before that 72 hour um, respawn. So, that's good. Can't say the same for like everywhere else, but so watch this guy's not gonna go down to that lady gets near there. Yep, see what I say. Come on, you lot. We got short blood up. Sorry, did that zombie just come from above or from inside? Because if he came from above, there's going to be a little bit of a problem. Fuck it. Fuck away. Of course, it's uh, another another part. Not, not even one that we've already uh, bandaged. It's got to be a brand new injury area. Hell yeah, I love it. shambling towards us. Uh, let's take some... Let's take some pills, is what I was going to say. Hey, zombie, fuck off. I'm taking pills here. I said fuck off. Take the pills. Alright. We got another guy down there. Lovely. Oh, we got some more people over there. How nice of them to exist in my territory like this, the assholes. Luckily, I was able to make short work of them by just doing that. So that's great. Nope. Another one. We got another one. I could have just been using the, the inside of this area like this the whole fucking time. Didn't I have? Hold on, we got another one. Let's wait for him. Hey, where are you going? Wait, it's about to be the only smart zombie in here, huh? 
there another horde like out this side? Not that I can see. All right, looks like we're clear. Um, it is currently 2:30, so we still got a little bit of time before uh, stuff goes down. Let's check. Do I have any food in here? Empty tin can. I'm just gonna drop this on the floor actually, so that's not like that. Uh, just a map, map, stuff, 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 damn. Hoping I'd be able to find at least a little food in here. That way I can top myself off before we go to the next area, but woe is me. All right. Are we looking on stats? Yeah, short blunt went up. Hell yeah, maintenance is slowly but surely going up a little bit. Well, we've secured our home again, except for the area to the south that uh, we saw that we're going to have to deal with at some point. But, neither here nor there. Let's go try to recover our stuff. And uh, I'm going to go into this side of the fence. We're going to just start crawling our way in. I say crawling, but it's more like that. Also, the way I got injured the first time when we were up, uh, when I started the video, is I was in... Uh, one of these areas, I was trying to catch my breath from fighting some zombies, and I kind of got snuck up on by like three people coming up the stairs and one person coming up behind me. I didn't see anyone coming up uh, the stairs in this area, so I didn't know there was going to be anyone there, unfortunately. As you can see, we've got a large contingent of zombies there. More of them are just pitter-pattering around. So what I was going to try to do... Rather than go down that hall, which just seems like a bad idea. Going through this way. I should probably close this door as well. It might be worth checking around to see if I can find any medical supplies or stuff like that that I could use here. Oh, incidentally, I did install one more mod. It is a mod that deals with uh, Molotovs. Because apparently, uh, Molotovs, uh, whenever you try to use them, they have this issue where uh, you have to have a lighter in your offhand. However, it sounded like from what people were describing, uh, when you were using a lighter in your offhand, the lighter is constantly going off. Like it's constantly being consumed. And you would need to have like a lot of um i think it takes the whole lighter to do so it sounded like you had to essentially take the lighter put it in your hand and throw the molotov in like an instant fashion so i'm gonna go ahead and drink clean the rag and then fill up our water bottle here here we go all right Let's check this house room here. I want to make sure there's no zombies in here when we, you know, end up going through some stuff. I always want to have a fallback point. We can get some food from here, though, I think. Potentially. Oh, I think I just saw a zombie go in there. Open some camp corn. Alright, so this is kind of new territory. We haven't been out in this hallway, and it could be bad. Okay. Hey, beta blockers, I'll take that. That. Well, I'm going to go back the way I came, because that's not ideal right there. Um, painkillers, take them. Never mind. I said never mind, bro, come on! What, where the fuck did that one come from? Are you kidding me? No. Fuck off! I, I'm not turning! What happened there? Like, seriously, what, what the fuck happened? 
I, uh, I literally, like, literally was holding down the right mouse button to face the zombies and attack them. Like, push them away. And my character turned his back to the zombies? What the fuck? That really pisses me off. I don't know why that happened. I don't even care about the fucking name anymore. Where the fuck are we at? Probably out in the fucking boonies again. God damn it, all the hell. Oh, look, we're all the way down here. Is there like... It's like a debug menu I could like turn on, right? I forgot how to do it, but I did it like once. Ugh. I'm not walking all that fucking way. If I don't find a car, we're just gonna die. Oh, this is, I've spawned in this house twice. Now, just a little bit ago, I guess three times, because our original character I think came from here. But uh, I know those cars don't have any keys. We're not gonna find any around here for a while, so we're just gonna die. How the fuck is this other zombie not fucking fighting me? Come on, hey! Hey, let me turn my back to you. Maybe that'll help you guys a little bit. There you go. Yeah. Yeah, nom on my flesh. So yeah, I, I have no idea what happened last time. That I'm kind of getting tired of the nonsense deaths here. Um, like the whole the people like there were some zombies that came in through the window for some reason, even though they had no reason to do so. Like there was no sound going on there, but they were like, "Oh, ho, ho, we're gonna come through here." We're even further away. Oh my god, god. Oh, we got a firefighter. Oh, we got a couple of firefighters. Hey. I'll tell you what. If I can get all this guy's stuff on without fighting back or moving before we encounter this guy, I will continue playing. Wow. I actually think I managed to do it. I got all his stuff off his body anyway. You know what? That's actually surprising. The only thing I didn't get on is these pants. Everything else I managed to uh, pick up. Actually, I probably tear. I can't tear the jeans up. Whatever. Oh, this guy. I'm gonna rip up everything so we have some bandages. All right. Let's see. There were two firefighters around here that means there's there's gotta be like a fire truck right let's keep our thing here open any keys on the ground no okay Is there not a thing here? No keys. Why don't they have any keys? They never have any fucking keys. Oh, that's a dead end. Where do the maps go here? Actually, this is the parking lot that I caught that other vehicle from, so there were plenty of other vehicles there when I last looked. Perhaps we can find another one in the same area? Excuse me, why couldn't you jump that? First time I saw that. Okay, we're just gonna... Across here. We'll just start killing zombies, checking cars. 
prick. Really? I guess I don't have any skill with weapons, but still. But you guys don't, though. Oops. Oh, bugger off, you. Get off me. Hey, none of that lady. Okay. Where's the cop's body? There it is. Get his bulletproof vest on. Get this watch. What else can I loot from these yahoos? Anything that'll provide me with a little bit of protection. Okay. The trunk's open at least. Maybe they'll. Oh, I see a key on the ground there, I think. Disinfectant if I get attacked and injured here. Yep, there's the problem right there. All those zombies down in that direction. I also need to find something to drink. Did I not wear this? Oh, apparently I can't turn when I'm wearing it. I'm trying to put that on, huh? Slowly but surely, I will kill all of you zombies. I give no shits. Okay. Thanks a lot to the apprentice. The progressive bit. The presence. kill this group, because if I get in the car and try to start it and it's out of fuel, we're going to run into a problem. Let's take care of these guys before. Oh, no. Hey, fucking... Ah! Get off me! Thank God for this fucking firefighter outfit. If I didn't have this, I think I'd be screwed. Right there, anyway. I like, just for a fraction of a second... Accidentally let go of the right mouse button and it almost screwed me over. All right. I just want to check them for any uh, keys or anything. We're going to die of thirst, though, real quick if we don't get something to drink. Bang. Let's check this car first. So who knows, maybe they have pop in here or something. They do not. I'll take these alcohol wipes, though. And let's also go ahead and put... Oh. Well, I didn't even need to wear it to know what's there. Okay, whatever, that works. Um. All right, key in the ignition. It has plenty of fuel. That's not too big of a concern. I'm just going to run up here. Alright, that was just a magazine I dropped a while ago. 
Let's go inside the food mart. Hopefully find something to drink in here. I'm gonna be careful not to uh, sting the glass for very long. Because once they break it down, they're just gonna flood out. Or not? Hey, over here, come on, come on. Not how much time I need to drink before I fucking die here. Okay, so that door's open. What if I close it up? So you broke that window just so you could climb out the other one, huh? Okay, this guy's not gonna, I guess this girl's not going to, uh, Oh, one more hit. There we go. I saw some gloves on her. No? Okay. Real quick, before we uh, engage with that zombie I just saw. Okay. Next one. No, he can't even get to me. He's behind there. That's fine. Anyone down this aisle? No? Okay. Cool. Well, we, uh. Oh, I managed to deal with that. Alright. Let's get to our car, get home. Hopefully, we uh, have enough gas to make it there. If not, we can stop by the gas station there, but it's fine. I can't believe I found another car in the same place. So uh, we're just going to go up here, up, 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 over to the gas station. I guess we'll fill up there, but let's go. There we go. All right, on the road again. I think the taxi that I found last time was like right around here. Funnily enough. All right. Well, I got to say that was. Uh, such annoying. Yeah, like, like I said, I don't know where those last couple of zombies came from. When, uh... Like, if those two... Like, back when we were in the building, right? And we, our last guy died. Um, if we... Would, uh... Not had those two zombies come in from the side there, I think we would have been just fine. Because of my bad luck, apparently, having those two zombies come in and just kind of touch my butt there was enough to make me to get fucked. Ugh, all these losers on the road. Roads for cars, jerk holes. Yeah. Well, at least we're adding to our car collection. We have a parking lot to put everything in, so that's nice. Also, when I was going back up to the uh, the house, I was looking to the west of the gas station. There's like a parking lot for the hospital there, and it looks like it's completely surrounded by a metal fence, which means we would have to construct less of a fence around the area to protect the hospital. So, that's pretty cool. Anyway, we're just gonna go around these two vans. Also, the more cars we have, it means that I can, you know, drive through more zombies and kill them without having to, you know, do other stuff, right? I can just mow them down, I don't have to, like, worry about that. I'm sure the car will take a little bit of damage, but 
I'll be able to kill a decent sized horde pretty quick. Maybe I'll do that if I die again and we uh, need to choose another guy. I'll make one who's not a Sunday driver so we can actually get some speed up. I'm totally just murder guy, right? It will be hard on the uh, the engine, but maybe I can back up and we'll... Oh, there's the gas station. Hold on. Kill the zombies around the gas station so I can peacefully uh, put the stuff in. Because remember, that generator's loud as fuck. my feet, man. It's fucking weird. Damn feet fetishes to zombies anyway, man. Come on. Okay. Got another one coming from here. Two more come from this side. I don't know how they heard me or whatever, but okay. Okay, looks like we are safe to fuel. Check outside again. Okay, we're good. So first up, first generator on. Next. No, no, no. Refuel from gas pump. Oh! Was that a zombie that just like blitzed past me when I sped up, sped up time there? Like up north. God damn. Okay, generator off. Let me just take a peek around here. I thought I saw one like go boom. Like just way over that way, but maybe that was just like a, a ghost of the other one. Out of the way, loser. All right. We're leaving out this side. Oh, we also have a truck down there that we have keys for on our original guy that we should probably at some point get. There's also the key on our other dead guy that we have to get back now, too. Yeah, so far we're not doing too well at surviving Louisville, huh? I really need to remove those two cars out of the middle of the road at some point, but for now we can just hold off on that. I'm just going to park this in one of the stalls here. Okay. How's our axe holding up? It's good enough. Do I have any smokes? I don't. That's unfortunate. All right. Let's try and recover our body. Oh, did you hear my car and come over to investigate Mr. Zombie? Well, that's what you get for investigating what you shouldn't. I don't see any more zombies around me. The problem will be if I start getting sleepy here in just a moment. Motherfucker. It's the fucking zombies, man. Why is it always zombies? It's almost like this is a zombie game or something. I don't know. I'm going to stand away from the trees, because it's uh, hard to see those ones that are dressed in black like that. Nice. 
Nice. This is how you deal with a horde of zombies, god dang. Okay. Not bad, not bad at all. Okay, a couple more are coming now. Ugh. Luckily, our corpses don't move around, so we, we just have to be careful about remembering where we died. Which can sometimes be a little bit hard. that are weak. Let's do it. Got him. Nice. Oh, let's check the back. We're secure. Let's keep moving up. See no more zombie here. Let's go ahead and kill them. Shall we? Yep, they're gone. Alright, now I just gotta remember which house I was in. One with the uh locked up windows, right? I think it was this one. Okay, I'm gonna stop running, because if I keep running, I'm gonna end up making a mistake and getting exhausted. And I shouldn't. Got him. Hmm. Definitely this house. Oh, fuck, that one's coming down the stairs, and they... What the fuck? I got, I got caught behind the stairs. Oh my god, that would have been bad if there were more zombies there. I would have died again. Okay, let's close this door. I can't easily sneak up behind me. We died, like, right here. I see our guy. Find the same motherfucker now. Uh-uh. I'm whatever my name is. And I'm here to kill zombie butt. Okay. Let's move over here. So I'm this side of the guy. I'm gonna start taking my former stuff. I'd like it if you guys just stay on the fucking ground. That'd be really great. Another one come up behind me, huh? Okay. Hey, prick. That's not cool. I'm just gonna have to not go in front of that doorway ever. One more still alive. There we go. Another one coming. I, I just can't go past that doorway then. Gonna lure him back a little bit. So this counts as maintenance. Any more zombies in this room. I don't see any more zombies coming this way, but you never know. I always gotta figure out. Oh my god, another one? Come on. Where do y'all keep coming from? I mean, obviously, I know where you're coming from, but. Why are so many of you attracted to this fucking mass of dead bodies? It's getting a little hard for me to see. Ah, give me his keys. The lighter. The metal bars. I 
Are there any more in this fucking room? Like, as soon as I leave and start looking at my guy's body again. Oh, they have a key. I thank you. Go ahead and just drop those. Cool. Lead pipe. Mine now. Need my body. My body, my body, my body. There it is. Alright, don't need any of this. I guess I don't have any gloves on. I thought I did. Fine. Painkillers. Some more ripped sheets. Some water bottles. Why did that startle me? I'm out. We already got what we needed. I'm I'm out of that fucking house. The house is cursed. We're never going to the basement one of those again. Only the second floor locations. What's wrong, buddy? You can't get through the fucking door when you're crawling. I don't even want to go back in there, because I feel like if I do, I'm just going to get my ankles, like, nommed on real quick. Okay, got him. Oh, now one's coming down the stairs. A couple come down the stairs. One did it while I was not even looking. Oh my god. Okay. Whew. Let's go home. I would, uh... Dang, imagine all that uh, maintenance experience we could have gotten uh, in addition to what we already knew if I would have went to the thing first before we came back, but we're, we're exhausted. We need to take a break. More zombies are collecting outside the house. Why? Why do they do this? I guess because the generator's making noise up there, isn't it? Okay. This axe is doing God's work right now. Not gonna lie. This axe must have like plus three smite on it or something. But uh, anyway. I guess while I'm moving, let's go ahead and replace this bandage. Oh, of course it's infected. Disinfected. Alright. Well, we managed to get our stuff back. Actually, there's... There's the lead pipe that I was using in there still. We're gonna eat some chips. I don't care. Oh, hold on. Let me clean the dirty rag. Green rag. Okay. Let's go in here. I'm going to drop off these antidepressants. The adhesive bandage. Um, yeah, I think everything else will hold on to. Oh, no. Let's dump the cologne. Alright, excellent. I'm going to come over here. To this one. I'm going to store my lighters. How many rip sheets do I have in here? None, right? I took all of the ones that I had. I'm going to grab half. I just need four. Screw it. Excellent. All right. Well, I think that uh, deserves a smoke here. Uh, okay. You got to love being able to learn it faster. Uh, love it. All right, all our skills are back, and that maintenance experience we gained before doesn't matter. Yeah. <sighs> okay. Well, I think for right now, everyone, I'm just going to call it here. We will uh, end things now. Uh, can we sleep at all? or We can. All right. I'm going to sleep first, and in the morning, what we can do is we can get up, do our thing, and attempt to get our other body back. Also, maybe go and uh, 
pick up that lead pipe that's still in the bottom of that house. Don't really wanna, but we'll see. Anyway, thank y'all for watching once again. Hopefully we have some better luck here in the future, but we'll see. I just gotta get better at, I don't know, doing stuff. Who knows? Till then, bye-bye.